When you paint models in Mari, even though it looks like you're painting onto the object, you're actually painting onto a surface between your viewport and the object. This is known as the paint buffer. Imagine the paint buffer as a pane of glass that sits above your model surface, which becomes active whenever you trigger any paint tool. You paint onto the glass, then move, scale and warp your paint on this virtual surface while visualising how the paint looks on the model below. Once you're happy, you bake the paint onto your model. This means it feels a lot smoother to just paint and allows you to make more artistic decisions on the fly because Mari makes paint and UV calculations at bake time, not during paint time. Your object could have hundreds of UV tiles and it would not impact the speed and efficiency at which you paint. You're always painting onto the resolution of the paint buffer, regardless of how big your project is, unlike object-based painting which has to make those calculations as you paint. You can also reuse paint stored in the buffer across different parts of your model. Just move to a different area, warp and scale the paint if needed, then bake it down. Or lift existing paint on the model back into the buffer with the lift tool, which can then be reused on other areas of your model. Imagine how useful this is when you're painting scales or skin onto a creature. When used with the paint through tool, which allows you to load in an image to project onto the buffer, you can line up photographs to create highly realistic textures across your models. Thank you.